amount of money that you can help me raise really means so much to me because it really, my daughters would not be here, and my son would not be here without John Hopkins Children's Center. So um, you'll find links below, and um, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. I'm gonna make this quick this year. I'm raising money for Johns Hopkins Children's Center because they saved my oldest daughter's life twice. And my youngest children were in a NICU in a hospital that's affiliated with Johns Hopkins. So any amount of money that you can help me raise really means so much to me because it really, my daughters would not be here and my son would not be here without Johns Hopkins Children's Center. So um, you'll find links below. And um, thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. It's time for Eric Place in Beyond Earth, episode two. So here I am. Here's little Sam. Just playing some Civ 2. I mean, Civ Beyond Earth, sorry. Uh, Civ 2 is a long time ago. All right, so here we go. We got this Earth Mover moving here. Doing stuff. All right, let's go to the next turn. So. I'm just trying to continue to expand for Pasta. So I establish a connection to one of my cities. Sweet. So this one goes all the way to my capital. Because I also have a to Very cool. Very cool. <coughs> this guy is... Let's see. Looks like he was doing a road. Looks like that's done. Um, looks like Nigeria is connected as well now, which is good. Let's go ahead and build a farm there. So, I haven't decided yet if I'm going to go for more of a uh, fighting uh, win or. Let's see. Lots of energy, and we're good on health. So I think this guy's in the miasma because every every turn it says plus 10 healed. So yeah, there you go, minus 10 miasma. Yeah, so he's kind of like in a state of constant back and forth there. So here I can get one science for academy improvement. I can get a new covert agent. Ooh, ooh that's a pretty nice one. Heck yeah. Very cool. Okay. So, uh, definitely the most scientific. Let's go back to a third over here. <coughs> Sam's kind of just waiting until it's time for him to eat. Alright, so, I'm not sure if I have what I need take care of that rock stuff here. Yeah, let's go here because that's faster. Uh, let's see, I need geophysics, which I'm not quite there yet. Let's see if I can do that one yet. So, because I don't have as much experience with this game as I do with regular Civ, um, I'm kind of running on autopilot, at least for this game. Not as much strategy as um, I would normally have in a regular Civ game. Looks like I need chemistry. I'm not quite there yet either. Uh, let's see. So if I go to science, looks like chemistry is the next one I'm going to develop. So I think. Uh, well, let's see. Is there anything I can do over here? Then I'll come back to this. And maybe I can farm these dudes too. Not sure. <coughs> <coughs> uh, I seem to have been kind of somewhat walled in on some of my sides here by my enemies. I've got some guys coming over here, so I'm almost about to run out of space to expand. I'm going to have to review what my cities are doing next turn. Alright, looks like I can do a mine. Or a road, or a generator, let's do a mine. Not sure if he fell asleep, he might have. That's okay though. <coughs> I 
Maui and Hina, ah, having no, seen the all the oceans of Earth, raised Very their cool. eyes to new oceans. With all right. Well, they're both there. So yeah, I should do that. Why not? Oh, good. That's where I has grown. Oh, look at that. Crazy movements. Have energy, but we were detected. That sucks. All right, so let's see covert ops. So this guy needs an operation. Let's siphon some energy. Let's do it. All right. This guy needs to know what he should be working on. Uh, um, let's see if I have what I need for the floating rocks. Okay, little Excuse me, you. I have important information for you. All right, so it looks like I have another person capable of doing trade. So I'll add a trade uh, convoy to this guy. Okay. Here on this one. All right. And I don't have what I need for that either. That's a real bummer. All right. Well, let's go over here. Clearly, he has one, unfortunately. Alright. Well, let's go make a farm over there. And this guy. Let's 
do an array. That looks like it would be very useful. So I'm only plus one on health. So I'm gonna have to be careful with that as I, my cities continue to get bigger and bigger. sound of something that's a wonder. So it's a bummer that I didn't get to that, but that's okay. Looks like my explorers are fighting some things over here. Hmm, I forgot the bad guys get plus five for Miasma while I'm losing for Miasma. Almost done with orbital networks. All right, and we're back. So we're just I'm not going to play too much more, but let's do a little bit more here. Let's see. Hmm, something up here, a paddock. I can definitely do a paddock. So um, so I definitely um interested in seeing what's going on here. Um. So I just want to remind you guys that if you do any donations, um, I'll definitely do 
Well, this may be helpful. Once in orbit, establish contact with Older as part of Emancipation Victory, a promise line of victory. Okay, and MIM Network. I forgot what. Um, what exact victory condition I was going towards? Let's see. What did I win last time? Let me see. So last time I got Transcendence. When I achieve Transcendence. So, okay. So I'm just not doing Transcendence. So Emancipation is fine. Um, we can do that. So... Right, and I wanted to launch a, a laser comm satellite. I think... That's why I had started that. So the question is, if I go now to my city over here, and I add to Q, can I do a laser comm satellite? Let's see. I need petroleum and titanium, of which I have none. So, I imagine that I will get petroleum here. Yep. So titanium, where do I get titanium from? Uh, that's, that's, let's see. So not from those guys, I don't think. Uh, titanium, titanium. Chitin. Floatstone. So titanium looks like rocks. Is there a mode by which I could see that? Let's see. Uh, resource. Let's see. There's silica. Petroleum. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Silica. Petroleum. Chitin. Where the heck is titanium? Xenomass. Well, it looks like I definitely want to get that. Salt. Geothermal. Alright. Salt. The heck is the titanium? Oh, not too far away. All right. So the question is, can I buy, like, tuk tuk tuk? Yes, I can. For eighty bucks. No, that's the wrong one. I think. Want this one? No. Which one has it? This one has it. So if I buy eighty, and then I can't buy that one. Darn it. Well, it gets me close, but not where I need to be. And this guy's advancing towards it. I'd have to build a city like about right here. <sighs> huh. Well, I'd have to build a city and risk their wrath, basically. Because uh, they're in danger of coming this way and this way. Maybe I'll naturally expand that way. Let's see. Is there anything I can build to help me expand? Doesn't look like it. Alright, we'll go from there for now. See if I can figure out what I need to do. Hmm. Well, for now, there's nothing I can do, so I'm not going to worry about it too much. Let's get some chitin. Definitely don't have to worry about floatstone. I've got lots of floatstone. The question is, do I need xenomass? Probably. So I probably want to build a city out this way. Except these suckers look like they want to do it too. A four billion year old world's worth of resources shared among a handful of people. We're gonna make a fortune here. All right. 
get us some petroleum. This guy looks like he might be in trouble. Select the unit and click its action button. Once launched, it will have an area effect on the tiles beneath it until it deorbits. Ooh, I like the idea of the ultrasonic fence. All right, find my orbital unit. All right, so I have a TechNet hub, and this gives defense, something else, and a five HP heal to every turn to enemy units, which is pretty freaking. It's a friendly units. Did I say enemy? friendly units which is great for defending my city so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and launch it I see so I can kind of go pretty much anywhere so this is pretty freaking sweet I'll put it uh, like right there that but another so that's kind of the that's that's our what you might call it our uh, well we're kind of deciding okay do we want this do we want that because we have to make a decision when it comes to uh, our satellites and what they can do so yeah okay so all right so I know I want this late game thing and geothermal I have enough of um, Indira, can I just buy that? Mm, I think that's... This is not being worked. I think it's the one right beyond that has it. Uh, alternatively... Because I definitely want to get this thing, so... Ooh, nice! Thanks for the host, Maglin. That's so cool of you. Thanks a lot. Um, I, I just discovered hosting this year, and I've been trying to host all my... Um, I've been trying to host all of my uh, extra life fr uh, friends, and it's great when they host me back. That's really cool. Um, all right, so this dude's gonna get pissed if that I'm near him. I can't do it there, and I want to be close enough that I get this, but I don't want to overlap too much with my current city, which is back there. Well, I think for strategic reasons. Well, what if I do here? That gets me access to this Xenomass. And then, uh... I can buy some tiles. do I get from seeing the trade route? Does that tell me like where I should build my roads or something or what benefit does that give me? Hmm, cool, soon I'll be able to do the geothermal stuff. I guess I can see everything because of my guy's talent. I think that's what it was, I can't remember. Um, all right, so. Let's see. Let's come this way so we can make a road to our new city. All right. Let's 
starting to run low on energy. I'm gonna have to start focusing on that a bit. All right, let us build our outpost. Within three tiles of another city or outpost, within two tiles of a station. Ah, oh, god darn it. Or along the edge of the map. Ugh. The station is gonna piss me off. I basically wasted a bunch of turns getting this guy over here then. Because if I go over here. What does this give me? Basalt? Titanium. Oh, alright. F it. I'll go here then. Hopefully he doesn't die from the miasma poisoning. Covert guys capable of doing anything like that. Good. Thought you were going to be pissed at me. I have something that needs your attention. Still can't do anything more than level zero. Farm. Uh, before we worry about farms, let's worry about building a road to our new outpost. This may be helpful. All right. It certainly is helpful. Alright, so what do I want to build now? Hmm. Well, for now, I'm not really sure what goal I have. Um. Alright, let's do biospheres. Ooh, and terraforming. Yes, I need a terraforming. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Forgot about that quarry. Alright, you can do this. Alright. Missile rover, you will protect. Let's see, where do I need more protection? So I've got two guys here. Let's do it towards this part of our boundary over here. We'll get more money, basically. And we'll get some geothermal. All My explorer is not in good shape right now. Let's see. Maybe heal up here. Be right back.
All right, let's see. Unit needs orders. Let's go on alert. there's any miasma here we'll send them to guard the top corner I'm not usually a big um <laughs> I don't know yet I'm not usually huge on military but I also don't like to have a weak one so that people think that they can come and attack me Crazy looking whale monster, just oh, an alien sea dragon. Oh, yes, okay. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's do that. Because since we do have some net positive health. Why is there an alien sea dragon? Right here? Because it's uh, another planet. Alright, let's see here. Let's go on alert. Our agent failed. Alright. Ooh, he can steal science now. Heck yeah. Alright. Alright. Let's look at my little thing over here. Did it become a city yet? Not yet. Still growing. Still growing. Once it grows and I buy this so I don't forget for next time, then I will end this turn. Founded. So let's go into the city. We'll buy this for 60. Boom! Now we have titanium. These are all the um, resources that the city can work. Alright, so. Why? That's what they can ask people to do. Let's do a trade depot. Alright, before I'm done with everything, let's just start up all the queues here. So we def so he can't build a trade convoy yet. That's okay. We can build a marine. We can build a clinic. Oh yeah, we definitely need anything that provides health. Um no earth relic. Hmm, might as well build a recycler. A thorium reactor, and I think we're good. Let's go to the next city. This is Mandira. So here we'll build a lab, a thorium reactor network, and let's see. So we can't build that. Okay, and a vivarium. Wait, wait next to that black thingy. Hold on. Let's do a right next to that black thing. Over here? Uh huh. That's just somewhere I haven't discovered yet. That's why it's black. And these guys. So the reactor, vivarium, lab, rocket battery. All right, I think that's good. We'll do one more turn, and then we'll be done for now. What are you doing? Our apologies. We'll refrain from settling near you in the future. All right, that was a guy from another place. He was mad that I put a city here. Why? Because he wants to have cities here. Let's 
see here. We have the guy in well. Flowstone quarry. Ooh, gold hands. All right. So this guy has built the geo. Let's go here to do some more geo. And after he's done with that, we'll definitely try and start getting rid of all the miasma. No village was ever ruined by trade. So he gives me favors. I give him this stuff. No, thank you. All right. What was that guy doing? He wanted to trade, but I didn't like his trade offer. Why? Why, Dad? Huh? He didn't give me good terms. You know, back when I used to play um, Civ Two and Civ One many years ago, I used to always accept the trade terms. Sure, 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 sure. But then I started to realize, oh, sometimes they offer you trade terms that are not very favorable. All right. But who are you talking to? The people watching. Ooh, I have a gunboat. Let's go over here. What right here. It? See, it has a gun on it. I'll go on alert. Other boats have that too. Yeah. Let's see. We'll do this first, then we'll clean the miasma. Let's see how we're doing on roads. It's getting close. Getting close. It's just a place I haven't been to yet. We'll explore it soon. Alright. This here? No. That over there, it's to that. This one? No, that that it's to that boat. That wooden snipe. Over here. That's, it's kind of like some lava that's coming up out of the ground. Oh, and beyond those mountains, the lava has a lake. That's right, there's a lake there. Alright, so I've got a new TechNet hub. I'm going to launch it. I'm going to put it out towards the edge. This is going to help. That? Launching a satellite. See? What satellite is it? It's to protect my my army. Ooh, another one over here. Excellent. This one will go out this way. Because I want a lot of protection for my guys. Why? So they don't have to worry. That's Daoming Sochua. What was she saying? She wanted to say, if you can go to my place, I can go to your place. Why, Dad? Right. Let's see here. Why? I don't know. But who is that guy? Alright. Who is that guy, Dad? I don't know. Yeah. So what are you going to call it here? Mm -hmm. Yes, the world is beautiful and unspoiled. But it is wrong. Correct it at once. I can finally build flowstone quarries. All right. Let's see. Do I have one of these guys that's... Oh, this guy's busy over here. That guy's busy Who, over there. Ooh. What did that go say again? Hold on. One more turn, huh? All right. Come out of there, you gotta heal. You might not survive. Let's see. Oh, he did not survive. Excuse me, I have important information for you. This this air here was not good, so he got hurt. Alright. So we will build, let's build a couple workers. Because, I don't know, it's just bad air. Alright, let's save. Alright, there we go. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Just saving the game.